karate chop point, even though there's so many unknowns here. They're really frightening. I'm so comfortable where I am. I make a good living. I'm flexible hours for my son. But it's not fulfilling me any longer. And then there's the what ifs. And I love myself. What if I can't get a better job? What if I get out there and don't like my new job? There's no other jobs, we know that. What if we believe there's no jobs out there? I mean, I'm watching the news. And I love and accept myself. Top of that, I can do this in a safe way. I'm not a bozo. I wrote, well, maybe I am a little bit. <laughs> I, can, I can rely and trust my feelings. Side of the eye, I don't have to jump into anything that doesn't feel really good for me. Under the eye, I can investigate any company I'm working for. Under the nose, I have more power than I realize. Chin, I can do this. And the universe can unfold the way it needs to. Collarbone, and I can trust that I'm always protected. Because I ask for that from the universe. And my vibration matches that. I'm not a silly woman. I'm very pragmatic. With arm, I always do well in business. What makes me think I won't in the future? Top of that, where do these fears come from? Eyebrow, I'm a grounded lady. I don't do things impulsively side of the eye and I won't do this impulsively I won't leave this job if there's not something better and with I I just have to trust that the universe knows exactly where I'm supposed to be under the nose I have to trust that my vibration will match that Chin, even if I have to tap about this every day, I can tap away the fear till I have a real solid vibration of trust. And when that vibration is solid, colorblind, I'll just move right into my new world. It'll be easy and effortless. I can choose that. I can go slow. There are always unknowns on the planet, but I trust myself to navigate through that. How'd that feel? Yeah. You know, the what ifs can stop us so much. And so I really would like to see you just really tap on those what ifs. Or like you were saying, you know, I feel like I shouldn't be here. I don't want you to judge your feelings, they're your feelings. I want you to love them, let them be here, thanks for expressing, and then ask yourself, is this really true? How can I know this will absolutely be true? Who would I be without that thought? That's Byron Katie's work, by the way. You know, it's really powerful stuff. Because I don't want anybody to go through life being a reckless risk taker, but at the same time, you know, we can't be 100% safe or we'd never move. But the what ifs can just keep us totally immobilized. And then what happens is we get more unhappy and more unhappy in our work. And then we're manifesting out of a really grumpy, bad vibration. I always tell people when they're thinking about making a job move, get that vibration up. Because you want to manifest out of that higher vibration. Yeah, 
And I also don't want you to judge your scary places. Just go in and love them.